To follow that breaking news in East Spokane tonight, we just told you about it. Now you're looking live at a massive fire from our sky cam. They're burning the 4700 block of East Sprague. This is right there near the fairgrounds, uh, just a little bit east of Havana. Uh, not sure exactly what is on fire. Some witnesses there are telling us possibly railroad ties. We're a little bit closer than we were earlier on our sky cam here. You can kind of see there are the McDonald's, the Golden Arches there in the foreground in that section, and the Costco building behind it. Uh, on the phone right now, we have Aaron Porter, who's on the scene. He joins us live yeah. by the telephone to describe what is going on. Aaron? Hi there. I'm down here at the Spokane Air State Fairgrounds observing this fire right now. It does appear to be burning in railroad ties. It's putting up a big column of smoke. Uh, it's definitely attracted a lot of attention from uh, all the people down here at the fair to go from enjoying the rides to seeing a big plume of smoke and flame. Um, the fire is burning right now, right in the middle of the train yard out here. There are flames shooting probably about, oh, I'd say probably about 50 feet in the air at times. Uh, the fire department is on the scene right now, but there's really not much they can do with the intense heat and uh, uh, the, all the oils and everything that are in the railroad ties. But uh, they're making an attempt to control that right now. It doesn't appear to be spreading at all. All right, Aaron, we, from our um, shot, we can see flames really firing up. Is there, can you tell, is there um, a train that's burning or is it just the tracks? Um, from my vantage point, I'm blocked by some train cars, but I can see the flames. And uh, it appears that they're just burning railroad ties at this time. Um, I'm sure if it was burning a, a train engine or a, a car that we'd be getting a lot more flames and a lot more smoke out of this. All right. No, but, uh, uh, oh, go ahead. Oh, no, I just want to remind people at home that you are a witness there. You're not an official. So we're when we're asking you these questions, it's just what you are able to see and what you can tell us at the scene. Yep. Yep. Not a problem. And Aaron, th those, that fire looks like it's just... Uh, uh, a little bit north of Sprague, but uh, possibly south of the train tracks. Are you seeing anything being uh, organized where they're maybe uh, blocking off streets or telling people to get back from where you are? Um, you know, down here near the fairgrounds, um, in the parking lots and everything, they're not doing any uh, work out of the parking lots here, blocking any traffic. Um, I'm sure they are blocking traffic out there by that McDonald's, mm -hmm. uh, but I'm from my vantage point here, I'm really unable to tell, but I'm sure they're uh, mostly attacking from inside the railroad yard. All right, Aaron, thank you so much. Hey, I just we just received a call also from a manager at the Shucks Auto Parts, which is really near there. Um, he says from his point he can see the fire, and it is, in fact, railroad ties. He's 100% sure. Um, so, again, nobody seems to be in the way of the fire. Uh, fire crews, as Aaron mentioned, are, are there trying to mobilize things, and we will keep you updated for sure. And we've worked on more information on this for you. We've got KXY 4s Andy Bishop heading to that scene right now. We'll bring the very latest right here on KXY 4 and updates on KXY.com.